A beef herd enjoys a meal this sunny day on Pembroke Farm in Lebanon. Note the little ones. Just about all these calves are the same size. Almost all here were born between mid-January and mid-February. You know, when we think about uh, having all the calves born at the same time, that means all the cows are at the same point in their production cycle at, at any given time of the year. Justin Reinhardt with the UT Institute of Agriculture's Animal Science Department advised Pembroke to have a more defined, shorter calving season, and this was accomplished through modern genetics and science. Like humans, cows have a gestation period of about nine months. Many mama cows here were artificially inseminated a year ago, a good financial move for a beef farm like this one. Uh, artificially inseminate all the cows at one time expect to get more than half of those to conceive to the artificial insemination so we can use bulls that might cost um, fifty thousand uh, dollars live we can use those for twenty dollars for one dose uh, of that genetics 20 farms statewide used ai technology on more than a thousand cows this past year part of ut extensions on farm demonstrations for many of these operations the shorter calving season means greater efficiency in both nutrition and herd health Pembroke farm manager Shane Myers felt his operation needed to make improvements, so he worked with UT Extension to change things up, adding an AI protocol. Did it work? In one year, we went from a 60% calving rate to 89%. The early calving season also matches the growth of grass in spring, summer, and fall, cutting feed cost. Um, I, can, I can stretch my feeds a little more and not have to just put so much into it. Um, that was another reason we went from doing a fall herd to all spring herd is because those fall cows are just eating so much feed and not producing as many pounds as a cow that can just eat grass. Pembroke looks to have one of its best years ever in 2020, all from getting an early start on herd expansion. For many beef farmers, improved genetics could mean more profitability. This is Charles Denny reporting.